Well, it's ideally time that Jet Airways is making its way back to the runway and this is because of its latest development of two flights that uh, uh, were of course in the Indian skies yesterday. One was a test flight that was conducted in Hyderabad and second was actually a, fl a flight uh, uh, that was conducted, a positioning flight that was conducted from Hyderabad to Delhi on its Boeing 737. Now, just to understand a bit of the concept and the key questions that all of us are asking each, each other is, will JET come back? And if yes, when will it come back? Well, looks like the road uh, for JET to come back is now meeting its uh, end because uh, looks like the government is now in the process of getting yet another airline back. Uh, JET Airways uh, newly instated CEO Sanjeev Kapoor along with his team have been quite uh, there uh, burning the midnight oil in order to get all the preparations on for JET Airways and yesterday uh, after of course they have applied and in fact reapplied uh, for the revalidation of their AOC which is the airline operator certificate uh, uh, the airline was uh, able to conduct a trial flight followed by a positioning flight and this was a long process uh, for them to come till there now what happens next is now that the boeing 737 flight is uh, in delhi um, the airline management will reach out to DGCA and uh, will check for them to arrange for a proving flight trial which actually will decide if Jet Airways will get the airline operator certificate or not. Once the airline operator certificate is in, Jet can get go back to NCLT and claim for its ownership rights for, after which uh, they can actually uh, start off with their agreements with uh, uh, various uh, aircraft dealers and uh, start with their uh, uh, process of launching commercial flights. While sources are telling us that uh, the process to this could be very quick, in fact, DGCA could take up uh, its um, uh, day of uh, conducting the proving flight as early as mid-May. If that process goes on right and if NCLT gives an approval after the AOC is given, then you could see the first commercial flight of Jet Airways, in fact, taking off in around October or November, if the current timeline is, is, is what uh, the uh, the airline has been talking about now this is not it in fact uh, there is more to it and let's talk about the indian aviation sector in this perspective because apaksa airline yet is an, another um, lcc which uh, is also coming up in fact uh, they are also awaiting their airline operator certificate uh, a development on the apaksa side is that they are ready with their fleet services with their agreements but yet of course waiting for their certificates in order to go on with their commercial flights. Suddenly, after the COVID pandemic boom, it looks like uh, uh, many airlines are now uh, getting on to this uh, runway of uh, flying the Indian skies with Air India back to Tata's uh, uh, Spicejet Indigo, of course, uh, being there. And now um, with Vistara, of course, and now, of course, uh, uh, the two new airlines that is uh, re-visiting uh, of Jet Airways along with Akasa will definitely go the domestic travel industry and of course will set uh, big hopes for Indian aviation sector. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.